the thrill of the buzzer is back. As lockdown restrictions ease, riders are getting ready to get back into competition. This Easter weekend, Harrogate Riding Centre are celebrating their 50-year anniversary as a family-run competition site. Due to coronavirus restrictions, the centre has been unable to hold events for most of the past year. Instead, the owners have been making the most of the time by adding to and improving their facilities. The site now boasts both international and championship outdoor arenas, two indoor arenas, an American barn livery yard and upgraded cafe facilities. The work finished just in time for the show jumping to begin and normality to return. After months of waiting, competitors are finally getting back in the saddle and ready for the next season. However, with such a long break, it's no surprise that some training is needed for both horse and rider to prepare. Natasha Cope has been riding and competing for over 40 years. Her horses are used to having a busy schedule. However, during lockdown, their training came to a halt. Instead, Natasha organised fun days out for her horses that she hopes to keep doing alongside her competitions. First, we've got a few sort of outings just to Westbrook Park and Craven Country Ride, and maybe the beach, um, and then just go into local unaffiliated show jumping and see how see how we get on there. In the next few weeks, Natasha is focusing on getting her horses fit and ready. Her love for riding stemmed from a young age and has kept her determination strong through the pandemic. Oh. I think as soon as I saw a horse, I just, it was, I loved them and now it's just, it's a passion and it's part of my life. After a long and quiet year, it's good to see riders like Natasha getting back in the ring, doing what they love. Although, like the rest of us, the horses may need some convincing to get back to work. Ruby Furby, Shoe TV.